Hello everyone, my name is Shri and I am here to do a tag video. I am here to do the Summer Reader Book Tag. This tag was created by Island of Books and I'll leave a link in the description box to her original video. I have not been tagged but I saw it and it's summer and I thought it would be a fun tag to do. The first question is Lemonade. Pick a book that started off bitter but got better. And for that I am picking The Magicians by Lev Grossman. Now I'm picking this because I read this book last year and I wanted to throw it against the wall. It was very bitter for me but I reread it this year and I very much loved it and I definitely cannot wait to continue the series. The next one is Golden Sun. Pick a book that made you smile beyond compare. And for that I picked Anna and the French Kiss by Stephanie Perkins. This book is so adorable, it's so cute. I pretty much smiled while I was reading this throughout the entire book and it's my favorite one in this companion series. The next one is Tropical Flowers. Pick a book set in a foreign country and for that I picked Daughter of Smoke and Bone by Lainey Taylor. This book is set in Prague. It has such beautiful writing and it's probably one of my favorite books I've ever read. The next one is Tree Shade. Pick a book in which a mysterious or shaded character was first introduced. And for this topic, I pretty much pick every single character in Gone Girl from Gillian Flynn. I didn't trust anyone in this book when I was reading it, and I still don't trust anyone in this book. Everyone is shady. No one is trustworthy. No one. The next one is Beach Sand. Pick a book that was grainy and the plot barely developed. And for that, I pick Allegiant by Veronica Roth. The book started out promising and then it just got slower and slower. I had no idea where it was going. It was my least favorite book in the series. And that has nothing to do with the ending because actually, the way the book ended made me actually like this book. The next one is Green Grass. Pick a character or characters that were full of life and made you smile. And for that I picked Leaving Atlanta by Tiari Jones. This book is told through the eyes of 5th graders Tasha, Rodney, and Octavia and I love these kids and this book is heartbreaking but the kids are wonderful. I love them, I felt for them and this book is just great. I would, I would read it if I were you. The next one is Watermelon. Pick a book that had some juicy secrets. And for that I chose Reconstructing Amelia by Kimberly McCrate. This book is a thriller and throughout the book the mother finds out all these secrets that she had no idea was going on with her daughter. And it was an enjoyable read so I decided to pick it for this topic. The next one is Sun Hat. Pick a book that had a vast big universe last setting and for that I picked Golden Sun by Pierce Brown. Red Rising, the first in the trilogy, had a big setting, but Golden Sun got even bigger, and I'm really enjoying this trilogy. I cannot wait until the next book. It is my second most anticipating thing after college football season, so I'm very, very in love with this trilogy, and all I ask is that several lives. That's all I ask. Everything else can happen, just let several live. The next question is barbecue. Pick a book in which a character was portrayed as a hunk and for that I chose Penn Hamilton in Sex Lies Murder Fame by Lolita Files. I haven't read this book in forever but I know this character. He was portrayed as a hunk and he was a writer and I believe part of the reason why his book sold so many copies is because he was such a hunk. So this is a book I chose for this topic. And the last one is Summer Fun, Pass the Tag Along. I tag Colleen from Creating Colleen, Raul from Latin Lecter, Stephanie, Joanna, and Akasawa K. And also anyone who wants to do this tag. Let me know if you do this tag or have done this tag. And thank you so much for watching. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye.